Welcome to the Cecil College Library. This short tutorial will teach users how to search for books and ebooks. As always, you'll want to log in to MyCecil, my.cecil.edu, and then click on the Library tab in the center. The online catalog allows you to search for the print books found in the library, as well as ebooks and other materials such as DVDs. Start by clicking on Online Catalog. Here you can search for a specific title, an author's name, or a topic. I'm going to start with a title search for The Great Gatsby. You can see from the results that it pulls anything with that phrase in the title. So many of these are books written about The Great Gatsby. Here is a copy of the actual book itself. Note the call number, as you will need to bring that with you to the library to find the book on the shelf. You will also find on this list the DVD of the recent film adaptation. Here at the bottom, you are able to adjust your search or add advanced features. I'm going to change my search to an author search for F. Scott Fitzgerald. You can either type the author's name this way or type it with their last name first. Now you can see our results list shows all of the books by F. Scott Fitzgerald that Cecil College owns. The Great Gatsby is a ways down the list. If I scroll to the bottom and change this search to a subject search, you will now see that the results list give me books about F. Scott Fitzgerald instead. Notice that the first few books listed are ebooks. You can tell by the electronic resource tag that is included in the title information. These online books are available to you anywhere, even at home. To access one of these ebooks, click on the small URL below the book's information. This takes you to the About page for the book. To open the book to read it, click on PDF Full Text option to the left. The table of contents now appears as a menu to the left. You can click on the arrows to expand sections and click on any section title to jump directly to that page. The arrows at the bottom allow you to go between individual pages of the book. Along the top are many handy functions. Here, you can search within the book, use a dictionary to look up terms from the book, email a portion of the book to yourself, get the citation for the book, or find the permalink that will bring you back to this book later. By clicking on Sign In, you can create a free personal account with EBSCO. Once you're signed in, there are two great features that you can use. First, you can save this book to your accounts folder for easy access later. In the future, simply sign in and click the folder icon next to your name to access all of the items that you have saved. The other feature is the ability to take notes within this ebook. To take notes, click My Notes at the top. Be sure you are signed in or your notes will not be saved. Click New Note at the top and be sure to click on Save. You can now see the list of all of the notes you have made in this book. These are now clickable links that will take you directly to the page that that note is attached to. This concludes the tutorial. If you have any questions, please contact the Cecil College Library by phone at 410-287-1005, send a text message beginning with Cecil to 66746, or send an email to library at cecil.edu.